real quick video just to outline the process of binding a Spectrum receiver. In this case, we're using a Spectrum DX6 radio and a Spectrum AR410 receiver. Um, before making any adjustments or programming setup to your model, if you have the equipment mounted in your model or it's just mounted on the bench, make sure that your motor does not have a propeller mounted to it. Uh, that way it doesn't spring to life and either cut you up or something on your workbench. So always dismount the prop before doing any kind of adjustments this way. Uh, first step for binding process is we're going to go ahead and prepare our spectrum uh, to be bound. So we're going to turn on the transmitter itself. And from here, I'm going to go ahead and enter into the submenus. We're going to go to System Setup. Acknowledge that we're going to disable the RF. Scroll down to Bind. And get our cursor over the bind uh, marker so that it's ready to go. A uh, note about binding is before we bind our model, we want to check our throttle trim. That's the ultimate high position. This is midpoint, and this is throttle low. We want to set the throttle to the midpoint on the trim. So we've got our trim at the throttle midpoint trim. And then on our throttle stick itself, we don't want to leave it up high. We want to bring it all the way to closed. And that should be the, the uh, position you go ahead and start your bind process in. Okay. Now on here to the uh, electronics. And uh, we're going to go ahead and we've made all our connections to the motor and to the servos into the uh, receiver. We're going to go ahead and power up uh, our system here, by connecting the flight pack battery. And on the 410 receiver, no bind plug is needed. It simply has a button. We're going to press this button down until that light flashes. That indicates that the receiver is ready to be bound to the transmitter. So now back over to the transmitter with the receiver flashing. We'll go ahead and enter binding. Binding. DSMX 22 milliseconds. Telemetry. Bind complete. Okay. And once you get to that point, we'll go ahead and unplug the flight pack battery and turn off the transmitter.